Hello and welcome to another review. Today I'm going to be reviewing Garcia Vega cigars. I uh, I just went out with a friend and uh, picked up a four pack. It is about 9:30 at night right now, or not even be earlier than that. I'm not sure, but um, I will be smoking a Garcia Vega cigar, and they are the green flavor. And the warning label says right there. It says tobacco smoke increases the ri <coughs> sorry the risk of lung cancer and heart disease even in non-smokers. So I'm gonna pull out a, a Garcia Vega. So let's work this up. Let me light this up. <coughs> so, I just um, picked these up at the gas station near my house, uh, Sunoco, near my house. And um, a few weeks ago, me and my friend had game cigars. Um, actually, a little backstory. Oh, shit, there's my phone. I'm dropping my phone. <laughs> um, a little backstory is uh, I've been smoking these cigars, uh, the green cigars. for about a few weeks now. Um, I bought up the games originally at um, Sunoco like a month ago, and actually I reviewed one of the um, game green cigars at my house, uh, on Facebook, and recorded it at my house, so. Um, yeah, I'm wearing my, uh, my spaceship shirt right now. Um, it's got all sorts of crazy colors on it, or different colors on it. So yeah, I don't norm normally smoke cigars. I only smoke them like here and there once in a while. So um, the Garcia Vega, I don't think I've been around for, or alive for 22 years now. And I don't um, think I've ever smoked a Garcia Vega green. I don't think I've smoked any of them. So for some reason, as I'm smoking it, it's going unlit, which is pissing me the fuck off. So, hold on. So this is what the pack looks like again. Let me get into the review in a sec. Um, the green Garcia Vega. It says natural. Is the It has some cursive writing on the back. It says two natural leaf cigars. Um, www.garcia- uh, Vega-cigars.com. Sale only allowed in the United States. 100% imported tobacco. Garcia E. Vega, P.O. Box 95986, Owensburg, Kentucky. Kentucky, huh? So I'm not into cigars. I don't really smoke cigars that much. I only smoke them once in a while, like on a weekend, if I'm like just showing my friends or something. So I inhale like pretty much every like two thirds drags. I know you're not supposed to, but if you inhale like the drag, you got a pretty good buzz going on and you'll feel like nice and like lightheaded. I find it funny how like most people buy the, um, the cigars and the blue green wrapper and call it like Dutch's and like buy it, like just pour the tobacco out and smoke it with the weed in it. I don't smoke marijuana or smoke weed, so I don't really do that, but if you actually, like, smoke weed, and you should, like, really try it, it honestly seems like a dumb, like, like silly idea to, from someone who's grown up in, like, the marijuana culture to, like, smoke the tobacco, just straight up, but... <coughs> it is worth it, because... It's like, you know, buy a four pack, roll up three blunts. I'm sorry to say, but <laughs> roll up three blunts and um, smoke the last one just with the tobacco in it. I used to smoke so much marijuana back in the day, but I found out it is uh, 
it was bad for me, like mentally, and it made me feel kind of paranoid sometimes. So I kind of just, I just don't smoke it like ever, and I probably never will again the rest of my life. So yeah, I got this shirt on. It's got the white, the blue, the red, the blue stripe, the red, uh, red bottom, blue and yellow stripe. So probably gonna end up. Uh, uh, here comes the car driver. Nope, they're going by me. Oh, I was on the high. Nope, that was by my street. <laughs> I heard some loud, loud bumping rap music, so I thought they were coming on my road. I live on a very uh, small, like, small little deserted road over in West Wilson, so off the highway. Oof. Man, that's giving me a nice buzz. I'm already starting to feel lightheaded. <laughs> The Garcia Vegas, I find it strange how I've never, hold on, let it burp. Ugh, fuck, man. These are so, 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 so strong. Um, the tobacco they use for the Garcia Vegas are very strong. I actually said somewhere on here about being from the Dominican Republic, so. I don't know if that's necessarily where they originated from or maybe that's like where the tobacco originated from, so. So this is what's left. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish it on camera. If I am, then I'm gonna have to swim it fast. The smoke is a lot thicker than a cigarette smoke. Um, I think, I'm not sure, but it looks thicker for this camera angle. Yeah, so it's a, what is it, Saturday? Saturday, I think it's sa Saturday. And the Patriots are on right now. I just have no interest in watching that sports stuff right now. I'm just probably gonna finish this cigar and just lay down and go to sleep. Talk to some of my friends online. Yeah, so this is nicotine. This is a stronger nicotine than the cigarettes have. So that's why when I smoke them, I only have like one here and there, and I'll have like one or two a night and that's it, cause it is very strong. Usually inhale like two thirds or maybe like half of the drags or maybe a little bit less than half the drags. Cause if you, if you inhale too much of the drags, you're gonna find yourself like being like coughing, like have a coughing fit, like be like, holy shit, like I need to stop coughing. <laughs> This is a cigar review, it is not a dip review, it is not a cigarette review, it is a cigar review. So, this is, this is my little hood, my front, my front porch. This is where I make my smoking videos outside. I sometimes wonder if like someone, hold on. I sometimes wonder if someone drives by that like, holy shit, what are you doing? You're smoking a blunt. And I was like, no, I'm not smoking a blunt. I'm smoking a Garcia Vega cigar. It looks like a blunt though. It's like. The way it like sits in the hand and like, you know, it's just there. It's like, Jesus, like this, is, this looks like a cigar. <laughs> I mean, this looks like a blunt. So. Um, if you have anybody who's interested in reviewing products, um, I would say send them over here because I will be reviewing anything. I don't care what it is. I'm going to review it. I'm going to get it done. So we're almost done with the cigar. Um, overall, this is a very good product. If you're at a gas station, I'm telling you, smoke the weed or whatever. Or if you don't smoke weed or if you don't smoke marijuana, um, just, just buy the cigars and just try it. Because this video has gone, lo gone on longer, way, um, or it's gone on way longer than I expected, so. Yeah, so if you know anybody who wants to, like, watch some cool videos, some cool reviews. I pretty much will review anything I get my hands on. 
give it a shot. Tell them to come over my way. So we're about one minute done to the video. I think I can finish this up in one minute. If not, I'll just throw the roaches out. One more minute left. I appreciate you guys for tuning into my videos. Um, I'm a friendly guy. I really get along with pretty much anybody. As long as they're not like talking shit or whatever. <laughs> I used to know how to do, I used to know how to like make a lot of smoke tricks when I was younger. Um, yeah, overall, this is better than the games, somewhat. These are better than the games, green cigars. Um, so if you're in like a neighborhood where they have like, or a state where they have like all sorts of different cigars, I'd say try this and also try black and mild wine tip. Because they used to sell that in my uh, town before the, the ban was placed. And Black and Mild Wine Tip is one of my favorite cigars. And I like jazz too. So, look at, we're almost done with the blunt. Jesus Christ, it took me 11 goddamn minutes to smoke a fucking cigar. Ugh, it's supposed to take 11 minutes to smoke a blunt. <laughs> the, at the end, it's getting sticky, so I gotta make sure I can finish this before it gets too sticky. So yeah, overall, it's like a good cigar. I won't, I won't put a letter grade on it. If I would, it'd be like a B minus. It's not that good, but I think the, there's some sort of cigar out there that's they sell at the gas station that's better than the Garcia Vega and better than the. And then the games. Yeah, so continue watching these videos. And. I will stop plugging myself and I will stop promoting myself because I'm not that great. <laughs> I just smoke great cigars. Garcia Figa cigar. That's it because it's starting to get really gross. So this is what it looks like when I finish it and put it out on the, the water near my, so I'm, the water dripping down from the rain on my front porch, front stairs. So real quick. This is what it came in. It has been destroyed. It's the four cigars. Uh, it came with two cigars in each package. So overall that means four. And there's one left in here to save for later. It has the Dominican Republic stamp on it. And I've already went over the uh, material on the uh, wrapping. So thank you for watching. This is Jack saying goodbye and see you next time.